everybody. Here we're looking at our um, Acer Aspire One 532H netbook. Yeah, yeah, it's a netbook that I had Windows 10 installed on there for a while. <laughs> I want to show you guys what the um, the um, stupid KB3035583 update can do to your Windows update on your computer. It's Windows 7 Professional. Watch what happens. You know, I've already selected some important updates and some optional updates to install. Take a look at what happens here when I choose install updates. Ah, downloading Windows 10. Now, Windows 10 is not 633 kilobytes. Oh, which, by the way, um, when I went into Windows Update initially, that was automatically popped up, downloading Windows 10. And let's take a look here. What we have in this folder on our C drive. Okay, you have to enable hidden um, files and folders to see it. Here we go. Show hidden files, folders, and drives. Ah, look here. It's our Windows 10 files. Taking up 5 gigs of space on our hard drive. Maybe the 32 bit is a different size. Let's see. Now the um, the 64-bit installer is roughly five gigabytes in size. Right now we're at 3.18 gigabytes. We're still finding files. Roughly about 3.2 gigabytes now. I mean, this is ridiculous. I'm simply trying to download updates to this computer. And we get this. And pretty much it's there it sets. You know you know how how it showed all those updates that we were actually installing? You know. It was at least fifteen to twenty, I think. I didn't really pay too much attention to the actual count. I know it was a good bit. Watch what happens when I try to reboot this machine. Okay, 15 updates. Okay, it's actually shutting down this time. There was one time before when it just kept saying installing update one of one. 